Web Design Introduction Designing a website is like designing a building. The architectural analogy between those two entities, website and building, is evident because of the common, complex and multi-dimensional nature of the information spaces created for people. Like buildings, websites have architectures. Therefore, in some way, the aims, objectives and work of a web designer are similar to the ones of an architect designing a building. Like buildings, the design of a website is a paramount factor for the happiness of the people who are going to use it and for its own success or dismissal. Good web designs provide logical structures that help us find answers and complete our tasks. Bad designs produce frustration. Through them we can't find the products we need. We are distracted by bizarre web elements obstructing our navigation. They remind us of buildings with dangerous stairs, kitchens with a lack of counter space, windows that can't be opened, and with misleading signs. Bad buildings and bad websites share similar architectural roots. Why? First, many architects don't inhabit the structures they design. They don't fully understand the needs of their customers, and they're not around to suffer the long-term consequences of their poor designs. Second, creating structures to stand the test of time is really difficult. Things that are used by people will need changes. The desire for stability must be balanced against the value of flexibility and scalability. Third, architects are often faced with complex requirements, competing goals and high levels of ambiguity. Frequently, web designers and architects have the feeling that their own customers don't really know what they want. Finally, transforming this chaos into order is extremely hard work that requires vision, perspective, expertise and tools. The architects have specialist tools and have completed full degrees in designing buildings. What tools do web designers have? They have user experience, UX, an umbrella term which encompasses Information Architecture, IA, User Experience Engineering, Graphic Design, Interaction Design, and User Interface, UI Technologies. You can design for gloominess, or you can design for happiness. It's your choice.